At 19, one thing you're not worried about is having a stroke. I was a waitress, and I was uh, working a normal night. So when it happened to Phoebe Dow, my right arm just felt heavy, and I couldn't lift it up. She didn't know what was happening. I was scared. I was really scared. She had had a rather devastating uh, stroke. My words wouldn't come out. I was slurring. One side of her body uh, was uh, essentially not working. I couldn't move my fingers. She uh, you know, looked like someone who was going to be severely disabled. The blood clot that caused Phoebe's stroke reached her brain because of a small hole between two of the chambers of her heart, present from birth. We're all born with that hole. Uh, in the first few weeks, typically after birth, the hole begins to close up. And in 75% of the population, the hole closes completely successfully. But one in four of us is walking around with a small hole in our heart, probably without knowing it. It's not a rare condition. Usually, that hole never causes a problem. But if you've had one stroke, like Phoebe, there's a chance you'll have another. You just take one day at a time. You know, if it comes back, it comes back. If it doesn't, I mean, that's just how you have to live. Until Dr. Smalling offered her a chance to try out an experimental device that would actually seal the hole in her heart. He was like, we're going to find a way to help you. The device is folded up, if you will, inside this tube. The tube enters the body through a vein in the groin and is threaded all the way up to the heart. And then it flares open and makes a, a little umbrella. We pull the device up. So now we're going to deploy the right atrial disc. And you can see it come out and then we push it up. Phoebe remembers those days after the stroke. I couldn't brush my teeth. I couldn't brush my hair. I mean, for the longest time, I couldn't even bathe myself. I was ashamed, basically. I was depressed. Phoebe today has recovered completely, though she says she still notices a difference. Well, when I smile, the right side, you can't see it, but I can see it. This side always droops down. But she is no longer worried about having a stroke, so she's out of the apartment, back in school, and getting on with her life. With Everyday Health, I'm Stephanie Sai.